Hi everyone, I'm Nancy. Welcome to my home. Welcome to my channel and welcome to my blog, Coffee, Tea, Wine, and Life. It's going to be a hot one today, so we are already at 81 degrees. Um, not as much, not as humid as it was the other day, but it's uh, but it does feel nice. I still have a little bit of breeze back here in the backyard, so just enjoying sitting under my umbrella here. Um, I think we're going to go up to maybe 84, 85 today. So summer is definitely coming to Minnesota. Oh, it smells so nice out here. So I have, as much as I love my blanket fluffy sheets it's time to switch them over to my summer sheets so i've got them washed and i washed them in my sensi the jimmy time the um laundry detergent the fabric softener and the with the wish washer whips and that's jimmy time and i just love that scent so i've got my sheets hanging to dry for a little bit and then i'll throw them in the dryer just to make sure they get kind of nice and soft but Oh, it smells fabulous out here with the smell of that. Just about all the uh, blossoms from that whatever tree that is in front of my house. All the, the petals are gone, so it's just a big, big tree, tree. I probably do have to get that trimmed again. It is taking over that corner of the house. But I've got maybe a crab apple tree on that side of me over there. And um, it fell over a few years ago, But and we were going to cut it, but then... But then what fell over was still growing so it's like growing horizontally and whatever so that takes over that whole portion over there so if um that finishes blooming i'll try to get a picture of that in there so it's pretty sad looking because it's you know part of it's standing up and part of it's like this and part of it's like this but it's it's still alive and it's still growing and uh yeah so uh yeah just try to do a few things today i notice i don't have a copy in my hand i am on my way out i want to go to the post office and get a few things out today and um yeah so i'm going to stop at um dunkin donuts and get a nice coffee so i'm excited about that and um yeah i've got a few unboxings to do this week and um yeah so and i've got some things that i filmed last week but i haven't got them posted yet but i will work on getting that done and actually i am wearing some glasses sunglasses that i got from qbc these ones are in like a green camo so so nice or pierre Rimo or something like that so nice but you know what the beauty is is i've got my reading glasses on underneath yeah they're like a not a do-over but a wear over glass right so nice camo it's got a little bit of bling on the side and this one's color's probably not coming out it's so bold out here um bright out here but there's uh, like the green camel so there's green and some golds and some browns and you just wear them if i can do it right you can put them over regular prescription glasses you can put them over reading glasses so nice so that you can still kind of see what you're doing but your eyes are protected they're polarized they just are so so nice so i got the this one and the one i wore last weekend in the blue um, I wanted to get the tortoise shell, but that one's sold out already. They do have black and purple left, so they're really nice. I mean, you don't have to wear them over any type of glasses. Of course, you can wear them by yourself, but they really feel nice. And oh my gosh, that breeze feels so good. Oh, yeah. So yeah, I broke down and put my air conditioner on today. Yeah. It's been, it's been muggy. And, you know, but what are you going to do? You're either freezing cold in the winter or you're sweating in the summer. But... That's the beauty of having electricity, I guess, and the comforts that we all take for granted of putting the thermostat up or putting the air conditioner on. But um, yeah, I'm hoping that it cools down tonight because I really like having my windows open and just kind of getting some fresh air and especially just the back side of the house. You know, from the woods and the wetlands, we just always seem to have this constant breeze back here. So that makes it really, really comfortable. But anyway, I'm going to head out for the day. I hope everyone goes out and has a fantastic weekend and a great week. And we will chat again later, everybody. Bye-bye. Hi, everyone. I'm Nancy. We made it till Friday. Oh, my gosh. And I'm actually doing my Friday video before midnight on a Friday. Isn't that cool? So anyway, I dressed up today for, you know, to start a Memorial Day weekend. And of course, I forgot just what everybody had today off. So there was only like, you know, three people that got to see me in all my glory here. So I'm either going to have to wear it again on Tuesday because, you know, I don't want my other co-workers to miss out on a fun look like this. Or should I just wait till 4th of July week? 
Christmas party that I'll be off then too. But anyway, I got this little, uh, little clip thing that you put in your hair. I got that from Amazon and I got this uh, top from Amazon too. Right? But, you know, I think I can wear it again on 4th of July. I think. So anyway, it's just fun time to dress up and have a little fun on the holidays. Life's too short to just wear the same old, same old every day. Am I right? Or am I right? But anyway, um, yeah, so another week is closing. Um, I left, left work about 11.30. I was going to stop at the gas station on the way home and pick up um, some wood. Um, you know, those little, little bundles of wood just to have a campfire a few nights this week and burn that instead of just a dura flame log. But, you know. I just don't feel like feel like stopping. Sometimes you just don't feel like it. Maybe I'll go out tomorrow. Maybe not. Who knows? But anyway, it was just another fun day. A lot of work. And I'm excited to be home. I'm excited to have three days off. I don't know if I'm going to stay home all three days or if I'm going to go to work. And I took home work just in case I felt like it. But I may not feel like it. Sometimes I want three days off in a row too. But anyway... I hope that uh, whatever you have plans for this weekend, whether it's going to visit family or loved ones or having a barbecue or going over to someone's barbecue, um, or whether you're going to visit um, your veterans at a local cemetery or one of the national cemeteries, uh, it's, just, it's just nice to take a moment to reflect and thank everyone who gave their life for our country. And then that's what Memorial Day is about, is... is yeah, remembering and being grateful and having fun. They died for us. They died for our freedom. So go out and make the most of it, right? Don't let their deaths be in vain. But anyway, that's kind of, it's kind of, kind of sad. And it's a holiday weekend. And forget, well, don't forget what I said. Just kind of put that in the back. Go out, have fun. I hope if you are meeting someone or going away camping for the weekend or going hiking or reading a good book or sleeping in every day, whatever it is, you're worth it. So enjoy it. And we will chat again next week, everybody. I hope you go out. Have a fantastic weekend. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for stopping in and sharing part of your day with me. It means more to me than I can ever let you know. So anyway, we'll talk soon, everybody. Bye-bye.